Hello, this is Dutchman420 again. Today I want to talk about switching my nudes. I gathered up quite a collection of stuff here. I was doing the Fox Farm line. Got some cow mag, and then of course Bush Dr. Sledgehammer. Everybody knows me from that probably. And dancing bottles and everything. And then I got some signal, and I started thinking about switching to the true plant science fucking shit. But when you flip the label around here and look what it is, it's just basically the same shit as the fucking Fox Farm, which is chemical nudes that are cheap as shit to make. It's just like miracle Grow. So I've been doing some research online, and if you watch my last video, you probably noticed that Scott Ossolander guy from the Nectar of the Gods and I've been watching some stuff about the Nectar of the Gods now if you think this is a lot he's got like 25 things that you can add but the basic thing is there's four of them that you can do and if you can deal with all the gods and the Greek gods and all the shit that each thing's named after it's not that bad it's all made of organic stuff and uh, he does no advertising. It's all done by word of mouth. And I started watching Bob from Oregon's Constant Gardener. <laughs> if you watch that, you'll know what I'm talking about. But anyway, uh, they always have him on there and they're pushing his stuff. So I was thinking about buying some of it and getting rid of these. Now I'll probably continue on on this crop with this stuff. I'm getting a little low on, I just bought this, but I use the shit out of this, but I'm getting low on the tiger balloon. So, I'm thinking about when I run out of tiger balloon, I'm ditching it, keeping the signal around, and of course I just got the mighty wash from my mites, so I'll be doing a video about that. But ditching this grow big, which is probably half full, and I've grown like five crops, <laughs> you know what I mean? This shit's so fucking strong, I barely use it. That's probably why I got a nutrient deficiency, but with organic, she gets harder to burn, they're cleaner, it's just better for the environment, everything else. So, just something to consider that I'm considering, and if you don't mind, probably won't be using this pH up and down as much either. Probably will, actually, because of the water situation here, but anyway the uh just give me a comment or whatever what you think about if you've ever heard of nectar of the gods or what or just organics in general i know organics are better but this shit is cheaper and i am kind of on a strict budget but i looked at the the stuff's not that much you get a cord for like 20 some dollars and i mean that's how much this stuff is you're probably paying for the artist that drew the fancy label. If you look at his stuff, it's a cool label, but it's all just black and white in these dark bottles. It looks like shampoo bottles or something. But when you dump the stuff out, it looks like freaking real organic stuff, man. I mean, it's real thick. The bone meal stuff that he makes, the, uh, God, I forget, it's liquid bone meal. It's like Neptune, something, I don't know, of course it's some god. Each thing's named after a god, a Greek god or somebody in like mythology and shit, so. Anyway, uh, just thought I'd put up so like a little thing, just what people might think about switching. Or they think Fox Farm's the bomb and keep Fox Farm, you know what I mean? Either way, so we'll think about it. Well, also think about uh, switching. All right, so just kind of wanted to put up a video and wanted to see what everybody might think about me switching to Nectar of the Gods. A little bit more expensive, but organic. And uh, giving that a try. I wanted to switch to organic stuff and ditch this Fox Farm stuff. I've done enough. I've got a couple crops under my belt, so it's not that big of a deal. Um, 
I got more stuff in my soil, and he's a turtle. This dude is a turtle soil dude, and I'm a soil dude, so it's all about calcium with him. But we'll get into that later if I get the nudes. For now, just throwing it out there to see what everybody thinks. Put a comment below, and if you haven't subscribed yet, I'd appreciate the support if you subscribe. I know what everybody's going to say, go organics and ditch this stuff, because this stuff is nothing but pure just uh, chemicals, like, you know, total, like, basically chemicals, man, but, ammonium, nitrogen, nitrate, you know, it's all just fucking chemical shit, and the stuff that he makes, Nectar of the Gods, is all natural, and it's all farmed properly from Oregon and they make shit called like Hades Down and something up where you just add it in and it's made a liquid limestone and I was thinking about buying that anyway just to, to adjust my soils but uh, this dude really knows his shit and besides him it's his partner that's like a mad scientist and shit that knows all about it but uh Anyway, I gotta start getting ready. I gotta go to work again, just like everybody else in the world. So, uh, you all have a good evening, and keep on growing and smoking.